Alright, so I'm going to show you how to pack a PK3 from all your assets for your map. Uh, first thing you'll have to do is make a new zip archive. It cannot be a RAR archive, it has to be a .zip archive. Um, then you name it the name of your map. Mine is UT4 Castles UM5T2. Um, once you have the zip named, you open it up and you add a new folder, which I can't seem to do here. But if you can't do it there easily, all you do is make the folders, put your assets in it, which mine is just the same here. So how I got those files on my desktop was I took my Q3 T4 folder, went to my textures, and I made all custom textures. So I put them in a s my own folder in the textures folder in the Q3 T4. I grabbed all those, threw them in the textures folder I put on my desktop. Then I went and grabbed the script that I used, and I threw that in there. Same with my level shots, I made a level shot and placed that in there. And after that, what you have to do after you have all your map, your BSP, and the TGA here is the minimap. Okay, so once you have all that, you grab the folders, simple enough, drag and drop them into there. Make sure you use zip archive format if you have WinRAR. Okay, add them. Shouldn't take long. Then, once you have that in there, you have to make sure the BSP file name, the TGA file name in maps, is the same, and the level shot name is the same as the name of the zip or you won't be able to load it from the name of the zip. Once you have all your stuff in there, that's basically it. All you gotta do is rename the zip to a PK3. And it'll ask you to change it. Yes, let's change it. Oh, okay. Yeah, I already have one on my desktop, so it asked me to rename it to number two. And from there, basically what you do is you load that up in your map, or in your Urban Terror. Alright, so next I'll actually show you how to compile a map.